What are some hygiene tips you wish more people knew? 1. Clean your hairbrushes. Especially if you have oily hair scalp. 2. Clean your glasses includes the frames and nose pads. Edit check my comments for a paper if you don't believe me on the glasses. Please wash your reusable water bottle. I know I know refilling your water bottle is super eco friendly but you got to make sure you're washing it regularly to avoid any gross bacteria buildup. Pillows cases need to be washed often. Maybe this is hygiene adjacent, but to stop that old laundry smell you have to leave your washing machine open to dry out every time. Perfume is not a substitute for washing and deodorant. Washing your ass. I wish I had known that the natural pH of vaginal secretions was acidic enough to stain clothing. And such. It would have saved me a lot of anxiety of wondering what was wrong with me. Yes. It is normal for this to happen. Cleaning disinfecting your phone. It has so much bacteria and I hate when someone shows me to look at their phone and that shit's crusty. If you leave your washing in the machine for over a day, please wash it again before you dry it. There is few things worse than being stuck in a room with someone who smells like a sewer dog. Deodorant works on under boob and cleavage. Washing your ass in the shower. Crack and hole my friends. Crack. And. Hole. Wash behind your ears and inside deep of your belly button. If you can smell you. We all could smell you two days ago. Nobody realizes the AMT of pee. Blood and feces are on the stall latch. Wash your hands. Clean behind and inside your ears. That shit stinks. Always pee after sex your kidneys will thank you. Brush your tongue. If someone offers you a breath mint. Take it. Assume he she is giving you a polite hint. Floss your damn teeth. Brushing isn't enough to prevent the bad things that happen to good teeth. Ask your hygienist to show you how. 90 of people aren't doing it right. Deodorant goes on before you start stinking. Edit wow. Thank you. Everyone. For the upvotes I was not expecting this to be such a popular comment. Close the lid before you flush. If you're going to have a quickie on lunch break. Then clean up after. I don't need to smell the boss's cream pie from 20 feet away. For God's sake, parents, tell your sixth graders to wear some deodorant. You are nose blind to yourself. So take initiative now to prevent problems if you smell yourself then it's really bad. But never let it get to that point. Wearing a mask doesn't camouflage not having brushed your teeth in the morning. Clean your butt. Especially if you're expecting to get a blowjob. Nothing sucks more than going down on someone and getting that dirty taint smell. Wash your feet. Including the bottoms I had a pedicure once where the nail technician remarked that he could tell I. Washed my feet well. I said. Doesn't everyone wash their feet? He said no and that he can definitely tell when people don't. I guess people assume the soap running down is sufficient. But it really isn't. Three years of a pandemic and half you filthy pigs still don't wash your hands properly. If you don't floss, try it once. Then smell the used floss. After doing it regularly for a week. It won't smell like that anymore. Dental hygiene is important. Started flossing at 21 and proud I've kept up the habit. Thought it was unnecessary until somebody told me to try the above.
You can wash your pillows and bath mats. Also glycolic mandelic salicylic acids for body odor. Keep that skin acidic and inhospitable to bacteria. If you have stretched ears, please clean your gauges. For the sake of everyone else who will need the bathroom. If you're going to sit in there for 45 minutes playing on your phone while taking a dump. Please courtesy flush. I don't care how long you're in there for I'm not the one paying your salary but you're stinking up the room. So flush early please. And then stay as long as you like. Don't keep wads of cash in your bra. Especially if it's summer. Money is dirty enough without being soaked in your sweat too. It's not gay to wash your ass. Get away from me. Wash your hands after you use the washroom. Seriously I'm pretty sure whenever I go to a public washroom I see 50 of the men in there just walk out without washing. Crazy to think. How to wash your genitals properly. Not just scrubbing it or running water over it. I am forever traumatized by that TIFU thread where that guy didn't wash under his foreskin for 19 years. Nail brush. Buy one. Use one. Change your work clothes daily. Came to take hygiene tips and got many. For the ladies using soap outside of the girly. Do not put soap in the hole that will cause infection and basically just make you smell even more. Bad than you could imagine cold sweat smile. If your towel smells mildew why? So does your body. Guys. Wash your asshole. Actually put a cloth or loofah or your hand I guess in there and give it a scrub. It's not gay. Same goes for under your foreskin. Close the lid before flushing. Wash your hands before and after the restroom. Deodorant is for before you smell. Replace your toothbrush often. Use a rag for dishes instead of sponges. Dry your feet well after a shower. Floss your teeth and brush at least once to twice a day. It really is important. I took a shower this morning doesn't mean you're ready for deep throat at 9 p.m. Wash your feet between your toes. So many people don't bother. But just FYI. You shower floor is disgusting. The soap water that runs off the rest of you isn't enough. Keep your towels clean. And certainly dry them properly if you intend to use them more than once before washing this. No point washing. To then drag a damp germ bomb across your skin. Err uh, do not put your cash between your titties butt crack real crack and then proceed to hand it to the cashier. Make sure to remove old deodorant from under your arms while you shower. Letting it cake on can clog pores and cause huge blackheads that need to be surgically drained. Improper oral care is a huge e-contributor to aspiration pneumonia. Maybe not a huge deal to those of us with healthy immune systems. But important nonetheless. If you have to turn off a tap, make sure you turn it off with the paper towel you used to dry your hands with. No point in losing all that hygiene to communally touched wet surfaces. Brush your tongue when brushing your teeth. If it's clean it'll smell like nothing. Because it's clean. Quit buying those nasty waxy pellets to boost clean fragrance in your washing machines. It's just a bunch of wasteful extra mindless petrochemical and plastic garbage. Fill the belly button with baking soda and then follow with a little white vinegar. Belly button lava clean. Washing your legs in the shower. I'm so surprised how many people don't wash their legs when they shower.